Big thanks to Urban VPN who's sponsoring this video. We all know the Amazon Fire Stick is awesome for downloading different apps and especially great for movies and shows. But there's a problem. There's a big chance you're getting this error. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can free up more space on your Fire Stick so you can download more of the apps you love. Yes, it is another Fire Stick video and I had to make this because the Fire Stick upstairs in my bedroom just was doing my nutting with pop-ups telling me that the storage on my Fire Stick was low. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can overcome it. Now, nine times out of ten, if you are downloading streaming apps like Showbox, which I wouldn't actually download. And after watching this video, I'm going to stick it in the outro. Watch that there is a good reason why you shouldn't be using Showbox at the minute. But of course, any other apps like Cyberflix, Cinema HD, anything like that, the more apps you download, the more space you're going to use. And in fact, when you actually look at the Fire Stick, there isn't really many apps installed, but when you download the apps through apps like Downloader, the file that you use to install that app will stay on the Fire Stick and they are what we want to get rid of to free up more space on your Fire Stick. So here we go, we're on the Fire Stick. You can see all the apps are installed as normal. But what we're gonna do is head on over to the Downloader app, which is that big orange app right there. And of course, as you're familiar with this app, this is what we use to download loads of different apps and install them to the Fire Stick. Now, quick tip, if you're looking for a great website with a lot of VPNs, movies, shows, app, live sports, then simply head over to streamdroid.org and using the menu button, you can head on over to your downloads or check out a VPN for Fire Stick for under $1. Now I've done videos on this channel telling you guys not to use free VPNs unless they are from a trusted source and I'll never bring you content or any message that would put any of your user info at risk. Which is why I've allowed Urban VPN to sponsor this video. I've already published a full review of the app that's available for Android, Windows and also a Chrome extension. You can find it in the video description down below. Urban VPN are a well-known free VPN. Unlike most other apps that are just clones of others, they won't sell or share your data and they will hide your IP address and even unblock websites that may be blocked in your country like Netflix US or even BBC iPlayer if you are in the States. You can change your IP address to play different games outside of your country and they have over 80 servers to choose from so you can connect to most countries around the world. I'll leave all the links in the video description so you can take advantage of a free VPN that just doesn't limit your bandwidth. I'll also leave a card in the corner of this video that will take you to the full review so you can check it out for yourself. But it is available on the app market. But of course, all the links will be down below. And again, thanks to Urban VPN for sponsoring this video. Anyway, for the sake of this video, we are gonna check out the files that we've downloaded. So if we head on over to files, you can see there are only two there. That's because I've deleted them from the Fire Stick because there was loads of different apps. So it might take you a while, but you may have a few more than me. And all we're gonna do is delete these apps, nice and simple. And to do that, we're just gonna use that menu button, head on over to delete. And that's it, it's gone. And it's a simple case of just repeating that process for all the apps that's on there. Of course, if you wanna keep the apps, then simply don't delete them. But after deleting all the apps, you should free up quite a bit of space on your Fire Stick, rather than heading over to your installed applications and uninstalling them one by one. That should free up quite a bit. But if you guys are still facing issues, let me know in the comments section and we'll see how we can help. And that's it. You can see how easy it is, but now you have more space. And what I would recommend is anytime you download apps through Downloader, once you've installed it, just click the delete button and that will delete the installation file from your Fire Stick, which will give you more space to install the apps that you love. And of course, if you are looking for some of the latest streaming apps, I'll leave a link to StreamDroid down below, which has loads of different downloads on it, but 
I'll keep that for another video. So anyway, hopefully you found this useful. If you did, consider subscribing to the channel and ringing the bell to never miss another episode. But of course, I'm going to be back with another one soon. Don't forget to check out that video which will tell you guys why you shouldn't be using Showbox. The card is coming up in just a second, but I'll see you in the next one. Honey.